Hello EYFS, it's Eleanor and this week I'm back with a new story. And this story I've decided to read you in my kitchen because some of the story takes place in the kitchen and something happens with the oven at the beginning of the story. I wonder if you can guess which story it is. It is the gingerbread man. There's the tricky word the gingerbread man. man. The gingerbread man. Shall we find out what happens? There he is. A little old woman made some gingerbread. She cut out a man with a big round head. She gave him a mouth and she gave him some eyes. She put him in the oven. Then what a surprise. Oh look, there's all the things that she needed, the ingredients that she needed to make a gingerbread man. She went to the oven and opened the door. The gingerbread man sprang onto the floor. He ran from the cottage and down the lane. The woman called, stop, but all in vain. <gasps> that means that he didn't listen to her. The woman gave chase and led the race. Run, run, as fast as you can, sang the gingerbread man as he ran and ran. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. Hmm, where do you think this little old lady lives? Do you think she lives in a city like London or do you think she lives in the countryside? I can see animals, lots of trees, some ducks in a pond. Hmm, I think she probably lives in the countryside. The gingerbread man ran ever so fast. A cow in a field saw him hurrying past. You look good to eat, moo, said the cow. Come back. But the gingerbread man ran away down the track. Oh, I really like the way that this story rhymes. Back, track. See if you can listen out for any other rhymes. The woman gave chase and led the race. A curious cow followed them now. Run, run, as fast as you can, sang the gingerbread man as he ran and ran. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. The gingerbread man ran ever so fast. A horse by a tree saw him hurrying past. You look good enough to eat, nay, said the horse. Come back! But the gingerbread man ran away down the track. The, uh, the women gave chase and led the race. A curious cow followed them now. A hungry horse galloped, of course. Oh, can you listen to that? That's alliteration. A k -k curious k -k cow. <laughs> hungry <laughs> horse. Oh, I wonder if there's going to be any more alliteration. The gingerbread man said, see if you can join in. Run! Run as fast as you can, sang the gingerbread man as he ran and ran. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. The gingerbread man is being a little bit cheeky because he's teasing them, isn't he? He's laughing at them going like, ha ha, you can't catch me. Hmm, I wonder what's going to happen next. He came to a river and stood on the side. He could not swim and the river was wide. Can you see the gingerbread man's face there? He doesn't look so happy anymore. What would happen if a biscuit went into the water? I think it might go a little bit soggy. Then a sly old fox came up and said, Oh, you can ride across on my tail instead. The woman gave chase and led the race. A curious cow followed them now. A hungry horse galloped, of course. A friendly fox swam round the rocks. Run, run, as fast as you can, sang the gingerbread man as he ran and ran. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. So the gingerbread man climbed onto his back. There he is. My feet are getting wet, said the gingerbread man. Oh, climb onto my back, said the fox, if you can. They're still getting wet, said a voice in his ear. Oh, why don't you climb onto my nose, said the fox, right here. <gasps> the gingerbread man did just as he said. 
The sly fox smiled and tossed his head. He opened his mouth and crunch, crunch, crunch. He had that gingerbread man for lunch. <gasps> Look at that little old lady there. Her face is like this. <gasps> I think that says that she's shocked. She's surprised. Uh-oh. And then the last part of the story changes a little bit. The last part of the, the, the song that the gingerbread man's singing, because it says now, Run, run, as fast as you can, sang the gingerbread man as he ran and ran. Run, run, as fast as you can. But the sly old fox ate the gingerbread man. <gasps> the end. Hmm. That fox, that sly fox reminds me of some other characters that we've listened to in stories before. See if you can think of them. After reading that story or after listening to that story, you might want to draw some of the characters. So I've had a go at drawing the gingerbread man and I've tried to write the word man underneath. So I've got my sounds, m, mm, a, ah, n, mm, and I did my sound buttons underneath. If you're in reception and you think you can have the challenge, you could even try and write the word gingerbread man. I've also had a go at drawing the fox, the fox. If you've got colouring pencils at your house, you could colour them in. I don't have any. And then I've used the tricky word the, and I've used my sounds to write the word k, ow, the cow. So see if you can do that. And then one last thing that you can try is, last week on Twitter, I posted a recipe to make biscuits. These aren't gingerbread biscuits, so you could find a recipe for gingerbread biscuits. These are just plain biscuits. And all you need is four spoonfuls of flour, one spoonful of sugar, and two spoonfuls of butter. And then you mix it, roll it out, and put it in the oven. And here is one of my biscuits that I made. I bet yours will be better though. Anyway, everybody, I hope you're staying safe and make sure to keep looking at our YouTube and our Twitter to see lots of uh, videos. And if you, do any of these cool activities or you want to talk to your teachers feel free to email us okay guys hope you're having a really nice week and see you soon bye